Saturday, December 23rd to Friday, December 29th, calls for above normal temperature. watch in effect from Sunday afternoon through Monday evening. What flooding caused by excessive rainfall is possible? Where a portion of central Pennsylvania, including the following areas, Adams, Columbia, Cumberland, Dauphin, Juniata, Lancaster, Lebanon, Montour, Northern Lycoming, Northumberland, Harry, Skookio, Snyder, Southern Lycoming, Sullivan, Tioga, Union, and York. When from Sunday afternoon through Monday evening, Impacts, excessive runoff may result in flooding of rivers, creeks, streams, and other low-lying and flood-prone locations. Creeks and streams may rise out of their banks. Flooding may occur in poor drainage and urban areas. Additional details, rainfall totals of 1.5 to 3 inches are forecast across the watch area Sunday into Monday, with the heaviest rain falling overnight on Sunday periods of higher hourly rainfall rates will be possible Sunday night into Monday morning which could cause locally enhanced flooding, especially in urban areas. HTTP colon slash slash www.weather.gov slash safety slash flood you should monitor later forecasts and be alert for possible flood warnings. Those living in areas prone to flooding should be prepared to take action should flooding develop. the 8 to 14 day outlook. Thank you for listening to WAHC. We need to interrupt regular programming to activate the emergency alert system. Please stand by. This is a bunch of baloney, but here we are anyway, so here we go. When, from 1 p.m. Monday to 10 a.m. Tuesday, impact, plan on slippery road conditions. The hazardous conditions could impact the morning or evening commute. Gusty winds could bring down tree branches. Localized areas of blowing snow and reduced visibility are possible. Additional details, the periods of heaviest snowfall and travel impacts are expected between 8 p.m. Monday and 8 a.m. Tuesday as temperatures drop below freezing. The Pennsylvania Department of Transportation and Pennsylvania Turnpike Commission strongly encourage motorists to heed all travel restrictions and delay unnecessary travel as significant winter weather conditions will make travel very hazardous. 
Call 511 or visit www.511pa.com for the latest travel, roadway, and traffic conditions. To report snow or ice, post to the National Weather Service State College Facebook page. Use Twitter at NWN State College or visit weather.gov slash CTP. Here's the winter weather statement. <sighs> Flood turn. 
turn around, don't drown when encountering flooded roads. Most of flood deaths occur in vehicles. Move to higher ground now. Act quickly to protect your life. Be especially cautious at night when it is harder to recognize the dangers of flooding. Please report observed flooding to local emergency services or law enforcement and request they pass this information to the National Weather Service when you can do so safely. The 8 to 14 day outlook from Monday. from this morning to this evening. What? Minor flooding is occurring and minor flooding is forecast. Where? Schuylkill River at Burn. When? From this morning to this evening. Impacts at 10.0 feet. Open adjacent land begins to flood between Shoemakersville and Hamburg. At 12.0 feet, Miller Street in Shoemakersville floods. Additional details. At 8 a.m. Monday, the stage was 12.1 feet. Recent activity, the maximum river stage in the 24 hours ending at 8 a.m. Monday was 12.1 feet. Forecast, the river will oscillate around flood stage with a maximum value of 12.1 feet this afternoon. Flood stage is 12.0 feet. Flood history, this crest compares to the previous crest at 12.1 feet on April 2, 1970. from this morning to late tonight. What? Minor flooding is forecast. Where? Switara Creek near Hershey. When? From this morning to late tonight. Impacts at 7.0 feet. The right or north bank begins to overflow. Several roadways upstream of the gauge are affected by high water. At 8.0 feet, the right or north bank overflows. Several roads are affected. Additional details. At 10.46 a.m. Monday, the stage was 6.5 feet. Forecast, the river is expected to rise above flood stage late this afternoon to a crest of 7.3 feet this evening. It will then fall below flood stage late this evening. Flood stage is 7.0 feet. HTTP colon slash slash www.weather.gov slash from this morning to just after midnight tonight. What? Minor flooding is forecast. Where? Conestoga River at Lancaster. When? From this morning to just after midnight tonight. Impacts at 11.0 feet, Crofttown Road will flood. At 13.0 feet, several homes are affected by high water. Additional details, at 11.30 a.m. Monday, the stage was 10.8 feet. Flood stage is 11 feet. Forecast, the river is expected to rise above flood stage this afternoon to a crest of 11.4 feet this evening. It will then fall below flood stage this evening. Flood stage is 11.0 feet. Flood history, this crest compares to the previous crest. From this afternoon to just after midnight tonight. What? Minor flooding is forecast. Where? Schuylkill River and Reading. When? From this afternoon to just after midnight tonight. Impacts. At 15.5 feet, flooding begins in Reading. Portions of water and canal streets are flooded. At 16.0 feet, flooding occurs along portions of Franklin, Great and Chestnut streets in Reading. Additional details. At 1.15 p.m. Monday, the stage was 14.0 feet. Forecast. The river is expected to rise above flood stage late this afternoon to a crest of 16.0 feet this evening. It will then fall below flood stage this evening. Flood stage is 15.5 feet. Flood history. This crest compares to the previous crest of 16.1 feet on December 14, 1983.
Those showers will affect northern Washington, Allegheny, and Westmoreland counties. At 3.30 p.m., snow showers were located over Jefferson Hills or near Gastonville, moving east at 35 miles per hour. Winds in excess of 30 miles per hour are possible with these snow showers. Locations impacted include Pittsburgh, Penn Hills, Mount Lebanon, Bethel Park, Ross Township, McCandless Township, Monroeville, Moon Township, McMurray, Greensburg, McKeesport, Franklin Park, Jeanette, Canonsburg, Latrobes, Gastonville, Shaler Township, Plum, West Mifflin, and Northside Pittsburgh. This includes the following highways, Interstate 70 in Pennsylvania between mile markers 41 and 57, Pennsylvania Turnpike between mile markers 46 and 92, Interstate 79 in Pennsylvania between mile markers 44 and 70, Parkway North between mile markers 1 and 12, Interstate 376 in Pennsylvania between mile markers 51 and 84. Snow will lead to reduced visibilities and hazardous travel conditions. Use extra caution if you must travel into or through this intense snow shower. Rapid changes in visibility and potentially slick roads are likely to lead to accidents. Consider delaying travel until the squall passes your location. Tuesday, December 26th. 